texture on it. So when you take a look at it, it's, it's kind of laid out three-dimensionally with the texture. But it started off just using the text with Helvetica, using the uh, leading and the kerning to, to put the spacing of the type brought into a 3D piece. So you just have the gradients for the back panels. And using the Transform and Illustrator to rotate it, you can do this both in Illustrator and in Photoshop, whichever you find easier. But it's giving you that location, taking the direct selection, pasting it into Photoshop as pixels where you can rescale it. You can actually resize everything here as well if you'd like. But that selection is giving you the part where you can make a copy of it. You can take the shape, make a selection around this, fill it white, and give you the selection around that part as well. And that'll give you the part that allows you to uh, back this piece if you made it transparent. But uh, it's pretty, pretty easy just putting a couple bars in there for graphic enlightenment and putting the title page in there for that section in there for the top and the bottom and then you can just make a screen shot of that. The last part just has a little bit of the texture 